welcome back to my channel. So, um, a little story time. Um, so we went to Target because we saw that Monster High Fear Descent Wave 2 Jackie Laura was in stock. And, um, we've been hunting her down since, um, oh, and if you don't know what that is in the background, um, it's downpouring like shit here. Um, I don't know what the fuck is going on, but just, just ignore that. That's the rain. But, um, yeah, so we went to Target because we've been hunting Jackie Laura down since we got Frankie. And, um, we actually already opened her in store to make sure she wasn't wonky. And before you guys say anything, um, just first of all, look at her. She was kind of, well, she wasn't necessarily wonky. She was just really bug-eyed. We didn't feel like a connection. Yes, we have a connection with our dolls. Um, we didn't feel anything between her, so, well, we already bought her, so instead of going back and exchanging her, we just grabbed another one from the shelf with the receipt, um, and we opened her to make sure she wasn't wonky, and, um, she, I think she looks really good. Um, yeah, there goes my headband, but yeah, um, that's probably what your best bet is, just grab one, um, get the receipt, and if they're not perfect or if they're wonky just go back open them you got to make sure you open them carefully and don't rip the outer shell that thing um so that way you can just let shove it back in there <laughs> um but yeah so i would recommend doing that but yeah so i'm really excited because jack is our favorite no offense frankie <laughs> um but yeah so let's just i'm really really excited for her so yeah let's let's review her Finally, starting off with the locker itself, um, you can see that it has Dracula's artwork, which is done by the fabulous Darko Dark. Um, I'm really loving his artwork for this new G3 line. Um, it says Dracula, and we will be doing the color change or the color reveal thing with the keys. We have the water because we said we do it with Dracula in Frankie's review, so yeah, we gotta do that. It says. I didn't realize how sparkly the logo was. That's really cool. I love this packaging. Um, I didn't damage it like I damaged Frankie's. Um, but it says Monster High School of the Bit Secrets. Fear Descent. And if I sound like shit, it's because I am. Um, I'm kind of stuffy, so get over it. Um, and then we've got that stuff. And then the back, it has everyone's artwork. Um, we have Cleo, Frankie, Claudine, and Laguna. I really want to get Claudine next, honestly. And then, um, Cleo, and then Laguna. Laguna's cute. I love Laguna. But I think I like Claudine and Cleo a bit better. But I'm definitely gonna get all of them. So, yeah, and you got MonsterHigh.com. I love Monster High G3, honestly. And then, of course, um, you know... We already opened her to make sure that she wasn't wonky. So. Oh, shit. And then just open the locker. And there she is. She looks so cute. Like, I love her so much. Like, ah, look at her. We're gonna uh, make her bangs lay down flatter, but just look at her. And I'm really happy because one, she's got a squishy head. And two, um, she's got the Indonesian screening. All of these um, fairidescents do. But yeah, here's Draculaura. She looks so good. So um, I'm going to attempt to take the insert out this time. If I can do that. It was really hard with Frankie, even when... Um, they were out of their locker. Yep. I got her insert out after the failed attempt. Um, yeah, oh, she looks so pretty. Ah, oh, I love her. So let's set the locker aside for a sec. And here is Draculaura. Just look at her. Ah, oh, I love her face so much. I got a very, I'm pretty happy with her. I got a very good one. And her bangs aren't that fucked. Um, but yeah, I'm just happy to have an Indonesian Draculaura. Because I still can't find her basic. Like, I have Indonesian Claudine and 
um, Frankie's basic, but I really want Jagularis and them, so. Is the key still tied with... Yes, it is. So, let's see if these scissors... I can't remember if these are the scissors I used last time, but let's see if uh, they're any better. Because I still don't understand why this is held with plastic ties. Yeah. I can like barely see with this camera in my face. These scissors are already doing better. I don't want to cut Draculaura's hair. I mean, it is poly, but like, there we go. Now I got her key out, which we will do the color reveal thing. I don't know if we're going to do all of them, but yeah. And I did cut some of her hair, but ah, she's so cute. So, okay. So now we can just like, seriously, again, there we go. And so we got our legs out. And then. Oh, shit. I almost just cut her hair. I wasn't paying attention. My bad. Oopsies. There we go. Sorry if you couldn't see that. I had to make sure I didn't accidentally cut her hair. Because I'm not driving all the way back to Target. And then my favorite part. <laughs> Alright. There. And here's her insert. I love this, actually. Like, I'm keeping that. Alright. Okay, we got Jaguar out, and... Oh! Her poly feels extremely nice. Her hair really does not feel like poly. Not even the ends are fried. Like, they don't feel dry at all. Maybe it's just my Jaguar. I don't know, but... Her hair is really nice. Like, for poly, this is really fucking nice. So we're going to set Dracula aside, and then here's her locker. We did hang up Frankie's locker, and we're going to do the same for Dracula. So here is um, the insert of Dracula. This is Slay All Day, which is really cool. Um, okay, so now we got to get her key open, and we're going to do the whole color reveal process just for you guys. Um, and I really want to experience it, so... Let's go grab the water, um, because I want. I actually really want to do this. Is we still haven't color revealed Frankie's keys, but we'll do that soon, okay? We'll, we'll do that soon. Let's just go get the water. All right, so we got the water. Um, so we're gonna put Jackula right there, and then we grabbed hot water, but um, it kind of cooled off. So, oh God, it's sticky. <laughs> Um, but, yeah, so now she's got a pink key. Okay, now we can do the other keys, but, yeah. Also, sorry if this video is a mess. Um, I'm not gonna redo any of this shit, okay? I'm having fun, okay? If you're not having fun, um, I, I don't care. So, yeah. Alright, and sorry for my horrible lighting, but bag number one, um... Damn it! Oh, I see. It wasn't opened all the way. I'm a fucking idiot. Alright. In her first bag, we've got a shirt. Oh, I actually really like this shirt. That's cool. And then we've got her other key. I'm gonna do the rest of the keys off camera because I want to experience this without this fucking camera in my face. So, okay. And then, oh my god, I love these like shawl fur things they're so soft oh i love them um but yeah that was bag number one and um you know what we're just gonna open the rest of these lockers with this pink key there we go and then we're gonna take out the bags fuck my drag right and then There we go. So, let's look at bag. I think this is bag two, so let's look at this. And, um, we gotta open it off camera again. Because we still don't have a tripod to open it on camera. So, yeah. BRB.
They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. You... Alright, so bag number two has the key holder thing for all the keys. Um, her extra key, which is actually chipped, so we might as well just do that. Um, and then she comes with her second pair of shoes. I really love the clear sparkliness to it. Um, these are her um, first budget doll shoes, just um, painted differently. These are really cool. I really like those. And then we have bag number three that we also have to open off camera. You know what? We're just going to open all of the bags off camera and then we'll show you what's in each bag. So, BRB. All right. Bag number three. I'm going to make sure I got everything out and something just went flying. It was her earrings because when we opened Frankie, um, we didn't realize that they came with this necklace. They're wearing it now. Um, but we were watching Carly Chester's review on them, and, um, we saw they came with a necklace, so we completely forgot about it in their review. But, yeah, um, their review still isn't out yet, but let's see re which review goes up first. Um, but, yeah, so, in Dragular's third bag, we've got her little earmuffs, which I really love these, and it's got, like, black paint on them unfortunately um she's got her black earrings and then the my favorite key is the clear sparkly ones i love these keys um but yeah this is really cool oh look at all that pattern i think that's all that came in her third bag um and because her fourth bag is uh already ripped i i really wish i could open these on camera but we still gotta get a tripod so we'll be right back again all right and finally in her fourth bag um oh this is really cool um we've got this like thing i don't know what this is um I'm trying to it opens i think um she's got what the hell is it oh it's lip gloss i think and then um i look i don't know what some of these are so just Draw your own conclusions. All right, so now I got Dragulora's accessories open. Um, I'm gonna put them on Draculora and then we'll finally take a look at her. All right, so I'm getting Draculora dressed in her um, artwork um, outfit and the same thing happened with her that happened with Frankie. I forgot about her necklace. It never came out of the bag, but just put your necklace on um yeah that's pretty funny like that's really cool so yeah now i'm gonna get her fur coat on and then we can finally take a look at her she's so cute and there go her headphones or her earmuff things i'm sorry all right and here is draculaura and all of her clothing pieces and she looks so cute um i did color reveal the keys um if you guys want to see that whole process make sure to check out my most recent youtube shorts and you can find it on my Instagram at Lalisa Loves Dolls. Um, so yeah, go check it out there and follow me. But um, yeah, here's Tracky Laura. She's so cute. Um, she has the Indonesian screening like all of the dolls in this series have. Um, she's got her earmuffs, which we already discussed earlier. Have a very bad paint job, but I like them a lot. Um, and like I said, her hair for Polly is really nice. It's like this light bubblegum pink with some black stripes like her original doll. And um, I just love her so much. Her fangs are actual fangs. They're not just triangles like her China variant. And she looks so cute. Now, my only concern with her is the fact that you can see her earrings through her head. Um, I don't know if that's just my doll or what, but the earring holes are very small. And um, you can literally like, I'm scared they're gonna rip the ear. So just be careful when putting the earrings on. And, um, yeah, she's got her, um, white necklace thing. Um, it's really nice. It's got a bat on it. And, um, she's got her, like, her light pink, like, shawl. It's super soft. And it's got, like, dark pink hearts on it. It's really soft. Not as soft as Frankie's. Um, again, I don't know if it's just my doll or what. She's got this spider web top with mesh sleeves. And, um... It looks really cool. It's really soft. 
And then she's got the same um, metallic plasticky like skirt that Frankie has, but it's not too bad, but it's really cool. I like it a lot. And then her boots are airbrushed. Um, I love them. That is silver paint from the keys on my hand. Um, but I love these boots. Like, look at them. They're everything. Like, look at those boots. Ah, uh, I love her so much. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for her. Um, so yeah, if you guys want to see Frankie's review, that'll be in the end screen. If you guys like the video, make sure to comment, like, subscribe to our channel, follow us on Instagram at Lalisa Loves Dolls, and we'll see you guys later. Bye!